Hello, friends and followers. Well, here's the front band switch on the uh, HRO 500. This one controls the HF oscillator. At any rate, I'm not sure what people did to this thing or why. I mean, it even kind of works like this, but it's almost like they sprayed some glue or some kind of weird silicone in here to uh, mitigate the shaft moving or something, I don't know, but I about destroyed this wafer assembly by trying to pull the old wafer out and it got stuck here and they pulled this stuff in and it really destroyed things. So I think I got the contacts back copacetically, but they're so messy you can't tell. They seem to work though, but well, I don't know yet. I gotta put the, uh, I gotta put the new rod in this thing and see what happens. You don't really want to be moving this thing unguided can get jammed, knock out some of the teeth. Uh, I found the uh, back part of this was dislodged from some of the teeth and it was sticking up so it was kind of crushing things. Anyway, I just want to get the new rod in here and see if it works. So that's what I'm doing. So I tried to clean this stuff a bit and it's just filthy. Somebody sprayed some kind of silicone or glue, glue or something in here. I thought it was the fiberglass rod shedding, but maybe it was people spraying some kind of weird glue in here or something. I don't know, but these things did not synchronize. They had play in them, so I guess I'm done with all this part of it. We'll see how it works out. So here's a new shaft. I got to cut this thing and see if it'll go in. So the other thing wrong with this radio now is I think the 500 KC crystal and the synthesizer harmonic generator, generator is dead because when I fire the thing up I don't get 500 KC harmonics, I get too many harmonics. So I think the burst generator or the burst transistor isn't able to uh, sync because there's no 500 kilohertz. So I guess I gotta order a new crystal. So when I had the big grinder in here, I could've kinda of put a grind mark there. Sheesh. I took a hunk out of that resistor when I was grinding in here, but I guess considering the magnitude of the operation, AKA foolishness I was doing in here, maybe that was deserved. So now it's time to cut this rod and uh, put it in, see if it'll go. Okay, thanks for watching, have a great day.